All right, welcome back to Churn. This is episode 17. Uh, before we start, I'm just going to come clean. This is not the same T7 side in the last episode, and the T4 has been changed. I swapped them over for the latest one, is it? Oh, may not be the latest now, but a later pack. Yeah, the cab suspension's been calmed down a bit. I'm not certain if I've got the same power as I had, so we will find out. Um, also, um, to show you, I have oops, changed the bail fork snap over to for the latest uh, bail forks from CZ. Uh, I had a very much an older pack on, I decided to change those at the same time. I will be changing stuff in and out uh, as it's updated when I remember. Uh, the JD is also not the same one, this is a slightly earlier version which apparently is a bit more par. This is version 1.4 and I was using version 2. I'll just come clean on that for anybody who might notice such things. Why the hell he's got the lights on? Alright, without further ado, let's get on with the story. Alright, as you know last time, uh, the owners of the farm up here, a few snags, and I need this up for this, it's on six, yeah, I know you should be refilled soon, you just have to wait till you're on there, uh, hopefully you can get done, yeah, that's it, a few snags uh, with their finances, um, infesting in the stock market, you do realise of course infesting in the stock market uh, basically means you gamble. It's like saying you infest in a horse race, or a dog race. Or two flies climb up the window. It's infesting to me would be uh, holding your money in for a... Oh, uh, actually I wanted to bring that back up. I want to just knew that before we go on. Uh, no, we're, well, we're good with that and just go over. It should all work the same in the end. Right, so we get rid of this. So we back this up. I'm hoping this is. I hope I've got a pop my phone. Yes, as I was saying, uh, it's like infesting in a dog room. It's not infesting. Them. Infesting to me would be holding your money in there for years and living off the proceeds of the dividend. Ga uh, basically gambling on a company to... Uh, yeah, that still doesn't look quite right. Well, we'll see where it goes anyway. Bring it over to that. And we'll see what this is like now for bouncing. Yeah. Oh, that's a bit better. For those who were feeling seasick in the last episode, I apologise and I hope it'll be a bit better. I'm going to miss a bit in the middle. But I didn't quite line it up right. I'll come in and do that after we finish. And before this doesn't take too long to finish this field up, we're going to go and spend some money. I had a phone call, as you know, from who was one of the owners, well, the other one got contact and she said you better get the money out quick. Bob is in uh, real financial trouble and he might be turning it all out. This was the uh, daughter of the original art on her. So uh, I shall be doing that. I think I'd better do that bit up there. Yes, so I shall be spending uh, that money. I was going to get a new tractor, but I won't have enough for that. No, we can't have everything. <clears throat> Did we miss it? Oh, we're still missing a bit. This is going to be a real mess. It seems to all be walking over us with the one. 
And hopefully one more pass down this should just about level this up. And still put Roy in there. Oh, he's still slipping to a lot. Should be more powerful. I definitely still need a more powerful tractor. I'm just gonna go and have a look at him. Just check the SX activate four wheel drive. Like shells there, I don't think it always works if it isn't activated. In the in the actual uh, course play console, we'll turn this round and just hopefully we can clear this bit up. And it's still slipping on. It's almost like we've got an offset on there, but we haven't. Yeah, so I've got a, a list of stuff I need. As we're going for animals, and we have to buy everything on this farm, there is no facility whatsoever for. Oh, that's a mess. Uh, there's no facility whatsoever for storing loose grain. Only by putting that in heaps, and I don't fancy that. So we will have to. Uh, Bail at all, at least we've got somewhere we can put the bail. My hand do this the last two bits. It's a good job we ain't got actually got a soil compaction on here, also I would be in trouble with this field already I think some of this I'd, I'd already missed on the uh, normal run down from the table down there I may well actually go and buy my goodies before we finish this if we need to I've got to wait till the bank Oh, I think the bank opens it, it's all telephone banking, you know, even for us businesses. And it's one of these uh, small private banks they deal with. You know, they can't deal with the Barclays or Lloyds or any of the other high street banks. They have to uh, deal with a small private investment bank. I think it's so they can put the money offshore so they don't get taxed on it. And I was hoping to be able to pull another track and then I'd get another employee. I know my old mate down at Old Ridge believes one track and one employee. I believe one extra tractor for the number of employees you've got. So if you've got, I believe you've got three employees, you want four tractors. Just gives you a little bit more room for manoeuvre when things are tight. What I'm going to do here. Now we finish this, rest this off. Hopefully, no, we should have leveled this off nicely. I'm quite busy as well to do all this by hand. Got a bit to go around the edge, but I'm not too worried about getting it all. And it's still not there. Let's have a look. I think that's too wide. It's on six. Right, uh, bring that down a bit. Bring that down to that. I move a whole lot. Oh, right of there. Now let's try. Take this down again. I 
The idea after this hard is to have enough money to get some animals in my field. Trying to find a field of grass somewhere, or enough grass somewhere to put enough in the BGA. Do that a lot, they don't like grass silage in the BGA. But I don't think I've got a lot of choice. Plenty of time to do this anyway, we're only on a, the first day of a two day growth cycle. Yes, I think it's saying even with real terrain in as well as the cab suspension this is a little bit easier and this can pull it away so I must have got to pick the right pile size again I will have to go out and reef I hope that John Deere can actually finish before I do or can finish before he runs out of diesel I'll bring him I was hoping to get, yeah, to get back to what I was saying about extra hand, I was hoping to get a, another big tractor for the cloning, put that on the uh, so seven roll or seven blade or play with at moments, and put the John Deere on the floor, which seems to suit it a bit better. But frankly, if That can't cope with. Hmm. What was that? Can we get round? Yes, just. And the bits we missing here still. Sometimes I don't think GPS actually reads the edge right. Things down this side. What we've got, bits we've got this I'm not going to worry about. Uh, the edge here, I think we can most probably not quite do that. That's part of the headlands. Well, we'll have to see what track is about. John Deere can just about manage that close on now, but he will slip quite a bit because because of the steepness of hills. We we're most probably looking at getting 500 horse in to really pull that thing round. And like I say, he should manage it easy. It's the uh, slopes which goes always here. This is quite a flat field. I think some of the locals too are quite happy that the word's already got out that uh, the owners of the farm are in a bit of financial trouble. Let's get the food. The smiles around the place and see locals look happy, I know. But as I intend to be in front of five, four or five people when we get going for the next four or five jobs, which won't be about. Good job in a damage mod on here. No, just lift that up so we can turn this. 
Nice slipping again, let's have a quick. Nice slipping. Now you can see, see here the, the slope is on. Luckily, it's only got two more passes to do. I'm actually going to go and get the other track. I'll get up with some juice on because I can't see him getting around. noise it's the neighbors having some work done I think and uh, some drilling again don't know if they're drilling for oil but uh, they seem to do a lot of it this actually seems a bit more up and down in the T7 I seem to calm the T7 down nicely but it's going be on You heard that note because I wish they'd make this map a bit more transparent so you could actually see for it. That's also the main road, right? See what? Uh, not too bad, man. The grass is growing on the on the split. Big bits of mist, but uh, we we'll get them in the car right areas. We... They go in front of them, hopefully. We can refuel them there. Again, I apologise for the noise. I, I seem to have this thing that they have to uh, rebuild the house every so often. Spray this with uh, some BB. 
I will do that after I borrowed the money and bought me a bit of equipment I want. Because I know what I have and I'll run out of money and I will get it all. Do the headlands after we fall, I think. The next time it'll be, sp won't be spraying. Oh, I'll be spraying uh, some uh, herbicide on, and I'm going to put N down on it. I'm going to spread some N on it, and the next growth stage I'll put some PK on. I'm really boost this up a bit before it starts to grow I think with the noise I've got from the neighbours, I'm going to go and buy the stuff and shut, cut this off there because this is, uh, I think this is going to be a little bit beyond a joke. So I'll just get to the end there and then we'll phone the bank, get the 200 phone. Transfer. Once I've taken it, we met some overdraft first. We you know what will happen when someone stops it. Yeah. I'm just not switching off. And we'll finish, I'll finish this off next time. Alright, we've got the uh, bank. Oh, one minute. Now, first of all, I want to take me map. Max Miller draft out. Now I want to go to the bank. Uh, and it on. Two hundred thousand. Take it out. That's my. That's what I've got, and I think. It's almost what I want to spend. Right, now then. Leave the bank. I will get the stuff delivered. Uh, Try to remember what we want. First thing we want. That's we're going to be buying. We want one of those. Because I'm not going to pick up my hand. Sorry for those who are hoping to see that. Also ready for the animals. I want one of those. And now the uh, one other thing we want is there. Come on. Looks like oh um, boy, and we want a baler. Right, I'm going for a fusion. We should have one other thing. Ah, here's a tank. Uh, what a slurry tank. But when we get there, we're going to have to deliver the milk ourselves. So we want one of these. We'll have it in white. And now we'll go hop back to the farm and get them delivered. And we'll just have a quick look at what we've got. Most of the stuff I used before. Um, just reset. Yes. Reset. Yes. I've got getting the Fusion 2 rather than the Fusion 3 for 10,000 for very good reasons. It's 10,000 pounds cheaper. <laughs> right. Now let's go and have a look at them. Well, the first two, you know, only too well. The auto stack for round bales. The feeder, which will go up to the farm, as will the auto stacker and the baler. This is the uh, the baler. I don't know if there's any 
any fancy bits on here. I think you have to be in the in the tractor to actually open the sides up. And then there's the cock universal tanker. Yeah, so that's so it doesn't seem to be any uh, end to the uh, drilling next door. I'm going to call it short here and I'll record the next episode of the series tonight when hopefully it's a bit quieter when we will finish that field off and finish this one off. So, and we will go back to our wait, wait, that will be my screenshot. Well, I don't want that. And as you can see, we've got 14,000 left. Well, that's, we're going to be deep into the red before we're finished. And I mean deep. That will do for that. Let's back up. Right, so uh, thank you very much for watching. Sorry about the extra noise on this one. Rather than just my rather noisy voice. Um, and whistling. Uh, sorry, so thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you like what you saw, uh, please uh, leave a like. If you're not a subscriber and saw something here you liked, I do this on Farm and Sim six days a week. And coming soon, trademark, is um, a series on the forest when we can all get together at the same time. Uh, multiplay which means that if you can watch me die regularly watch uh, Sean sh show his amazing fighting uh, abilities and BP collect everything in sight I'm not certain what Scooter Rail's speciality is yet but he's rather busy in real life at the moment so we're, we're hoping that he can make it so with that oh any comments uh, please feel free to comment and with that, it's Mammon saying cheerio for now. Cheerio.